our consciousness. We grapple with the burden of creating our essence through our action. There is no predetermined essence, no fixed human nature, but an ever-evolving identity sculpted by the decisions we make. Sartre famously declares, existence precedes essence. compares this experience to being abandoned on a deserted island, with no preordained path to follow. The weight of our decisions echoes in the emptiness of this existential desert. The other, too, becomes a crucial element in this existential drama. Sartre introduces the concept of, the look, the gaze of the other that objectifies and scrutinizes us. In the eyes of our peers, we become aware of our own subjectivity and the judgment that accompanies our actions. The look becomes a mirror reflecting the anxiety of our freedom, as we grapple with the awareness of being observed and evaluated. In this relentless pursuit of authenticity, responsibility that comes with being condemned to be free. We are condemned to be free, thrust into a world where every action is a conscious choice, and the responsibility for those choices rests squarely on our shoulders. This freedom, though liberating, can be overwhelming, akin to standing on the edge of a bottomless pit. In the solitude of our consciousness, we grapple with the burden of creating our essence through our actions. There is no predetermined essence.